tell me you didn't just ask what I think you did. I just want to know how you did it. How did you talk Miguel into making a baby with you? That's none of your business. And who said I talked him into anything? I didn't mean... I mean, I, I just got the impression it wasn't something the two of you planned. Well, no. It's not like I tricked him or anything. There, there were deep feelings involved. We got carried away, okay? <laughs> okay. So how do I do that with Miguel? You don't. That's how you keep your hands off him. Why? Are you in love with him too? Okay, the siren. <laughs> There's a big difference between being in love with someone and loving them. There is. Are you sure you're from New Hampshire and not some other planet? Well, that's not nice. Okay, fine. The reason that I care about Miguel isn't because I'm in love with him, but I do love him as a friend. And when we go way back, he means a lot to me. Like a brother. Well... So if you're not in love with him, why can't I have a baby with him? Because you can't, that's why. It's just not the way you do things. But you did. And so did Tabitha, and she's really old. Uh, how am I going to get through to you? And I love Maria and Dora. They're so cute and sweet. I want one of my own. Okay. If you wanted a baby so bad, then why didn't you have one with your boyfriend? Boyfriend? Yeah. The guy you say left you last night, stole all your clothes? That boyfriend? Right. Uh, well, he wasn't ready to have a baby. Oh, neither is Miguel. Okay, he already has enough on his plate helping me with Maria. He doesn't need another child. That's what Miguel said. But I think I can change his mind. You told Miguel that you wanted to have his baby? Yes. I don't believe you. Uh -huh. <laughs> Ready to go swimming? Always. <laughs> Well, Saren, I gotta admit, you know, I was known as quite a swimmer back in school, but you swim circles around me. Circles? I can do that. Aren't you getting dizzy yet? <laughs> Not a bit. <laughs> okay, well, I am, so stop. <laughs> What's the matter? I don't know. I have this funny feeling I've never had before in my tummy. Are you and Kay close friends? <laughs> More than friends, we're in love. We're getting married. And you're not jealous of her when she's with Miguel? Oh. Not anymore, I admit. I've had a few visits from the green-eyed monster, but... Who's he? It's just an expression. The point is, is I've had to check myself and my jealousy over the relationship. Miguel's not a threat to me and Kay. She told you that? Yeah, and I believe her. And I'm sure they're close, but it's because they have a child together. They have lots of history. They grew up together. Hmm. You don't believe that they're... Just friends. I don't know. I just wonder whether close friends with a child and a lot of history can sometimes become more than friends. Yeah, sure, it happens, but not with those two. <laughs> you know, you really are different from other girls, Siren. <laughs> Is that good or bad? I think it's a good thing. It's refreshing. All I know is that I say what I think. <laughs> yeah, so I've noticed. You really like Miguel, don't you? Yes. I want him to be the father of my child, too. Right. So, uh, you want to race across the pool? You're on. All right. I'm three. Ready? One, two, three. What the hell? It couldn't have been. I won. Why'd you stop? 
Okay, call me crazy, but I could have sworn I just saw Finn where your legs were supposed to be just now when we were racing. What? So much chlorine in your eyes, buddy. Maybe. <laughs> Okay, I've completely lost it. Not only do you have legs, but you have gorgeous ones. Thank you. Not as beautiful as Kay's legs. My eyes are definitely playing tricks on me. Too bad. The boys wanted to meet a mermaid. <sighs> are you ready for another race? <laughs> you coming in, Kay? Not right now. Well, then I'm getting out. Miguel, good luck. My money is on the way. 